Hello and welcome. Today we are taking a look at Black Geyser, Couriers of Darkness. This is a, it's a classic RPG, something like uh, like Baldur's Gate or, or Icewind Dale, that style of thing, the original Baldur's Gates, where we are going to be out to recruiting a party uh, uh, and venturing across a fantasy world. Uh, it, apparently there's a bit of, of open-endedness to this where our, dis our choices will will sway the uh, the way the game goes, but it's by, uh, by Great Potion Technologies, and it's out here in early access on the 26th of August. This went through Kickstarter, I guess, a few years back, and uh, it's just now hitting early access. They give me an early look at this early access thing, so we're going to check it out and uh, see what we can do here. So, uh, li like Baldur's Gate, you get to create one character, and you'll find other folks that are out there in the world that will uh, join up with us. So, of course, we're going to make our own and see what that's all about. Uh, and and build ourselves uh, somebody. Um, now there's a lot of variety in here. We uh, you know humans and dwarves and elves and all that. Uh, however, some of the races can't be certain classes. So as much as I want to be a dwarf necromancer, uh, I can't. So there's quite a few um, classes. We're gonna go pick a human because it, it uh, allows everything. Um, clearly, that's Leonardo DiCaprio. Uh, we have elves. We have uh, we have Feldigugs. Uh, and we also have Rillo, who are some folks with uh, parrot hats and, and, and teeth. Uh, I'm going to go and be a, uh, a human. I'll be a male human. Uh, because I can be any class and I can show what, what classes are in the game. So, there's a bunch. Uh, I'm not sure what a convoker is. Magical uh, pursuits kind of guy. We've got rangers. Uh, we've got swindlers. Winter mage. Yeah, some cool things in here. I guess we'll find other folks. I'm not sure how many people we can get in our party. Um, but for now, of course, I'm going to go with the Necromancer. Uh, also, we can actually add other classes. We can multi-class this as well. So I guess I could be a Necromancer Shaman, I suppose. I don't know. We'll stick with... Uh, I kind of want to see what that is. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm going to be a Necromancer Fighter. Yeah, that sounds like a, like a class. Let's do it. Uh, for my, my attributes, we can choose all these, you know, focus that way. We, we're going to allocate it and let the game do the thing for us. It's putting it mostly in focus because that's what we need for magey kind of things. And physique, because we are a punching necromancer with glowy hands. Uh, resistances, um, let's put it in, uh, let's, let's resist some cold. Like, let's pick one to be really good at. Forget the others. We'll leave one in there. All right, next, uh, general skills. We're going to go with a little bit of learning and research. And maybe a bit of, well, maybe Prodigy probably is a good one to have. Enables additional dialogue choices themed around wizardry. This is mostly, yeah, talking things. Yeah, that seems like a good thing for me. And uh, weapons. I'm going to use a rod or stay. I'm going to smack folks with it real hard. Okay. Uh, in my initial spells, I get one. Oh, interesting. Because I chose, I guess, fighter, I only get one. Each. Last time I got two. So I will begin with... Oh, man, I really want to show the stone wall off because it's really cool looking. The spell effect was really cool looking. Um, You know what? Uh, no, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I will pick... I'm going to go with sn the, the Snowball. Or what's the Fever do? Sends a spell-induced Fever to attack its target, causing a sense of intense heat engulfing its body. Inflicts weakness, throbbing, and toasting on the target. Toasting? Um, yeah, you know what? Let's try this one so we can, we can like, give him a good Fever and then smack him with our staff. No, you know what? We're going Stonewall because it's a really cool magical effect and I want to show it off. So that's the idea. Uh, my major colors are going to be... I'm a, I mean, I'm a necromancer. Raven. Raven, is it? Uh, my, my minor color. I mean, raven. Ra more raven. Can I have a little more raven there, please? My, I call it raven. Uh, my skin color is bisque. I, I like it. Ooh, that's, that's, that's good. That's good. Hair color, uh, raven. Okay, okay. And my hairstyle is um, a little lumberjack. And I'm going to have a little bit of a... Uh, no, no, no. We'll go with uh, with a. Yeah, can I get like a nice? Oh yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, whereas me, I believe I look just like that guy. Okay. My name. Uh, my name is is uh is Nook. Uh, no, no, no. My my name is Ontinti. And I have my voice. How do I sound? Hmm. Okay. What? <laughs> yes. Okay. Yep. Where's the will? That's yes, me. Uh, what? Yeah, that, that's me. There's Ontinti, uh, master of fighting necromancy things. Uh, let's begin. 
Okay, so uh, we're going to be a bit of some story things in here and tutorial kind of things, but it should lead us into the game and kind of get an idea of what, what we're getting into. Um, if if you have a soft spot for the old CRPGs, you know, the old uh, uh, Interplay? Is that who it was? Um, uh, uh, Baldur's Gate and Icewind Dale and Neverwinter Nights. All that old stuff. That's what we got oh, here. Why didn't I look here first? And more to the point... Why must I come fetch you for every little thing? Um, who are you supposed to be? Har har, you are so very droll. I know. Ugh, you'd better hope Lord Espen is in as good a humor today. You do know this is the day the Lords of Isselbright are visiting. Ugh, please, don't answer. Alright. The Lords are uh, okay. already here and waiting to be served. And for goodness sake, don't forget to gather your things from your chest before you come to table. Okay, so I am a servant, of course, and uh, we're going to go, well, we're going to go serve. Uh, in this little courtyard here, we can walk around and, and get an idea of some, some buttons here. I'll show off a bit, follow the tutorial here. Um, we have side quests, uh, we have a, a journal, we've got a compendium, we have greed also, which is going to affect the world of Yerengel faintly. can barely be felt, but those with keen sense might start to feel its effect. Costs of living are on the rise throughout Yerengel, and albeit ever so slightly, this one can feel the winds of change. Interesting. And our personal qualities as well, which we're going to Id idolize, of course. Uh, well, all right, we can talk to all these. <laughs> I would turn him down, uh, <laughs> but it's it's hilarious, and uh, it's so funny. He's making me hiccup. Um, I stand with but it, the king. I can't turn it off, so it, you get it if you want to hear any other dialogue. Uh, some people are they're just having a little chat there. Uh, Sir, Sir Gavilon is uh, getting shut down at the moment. Let's go. Uh, let's go see some gameplay things. Excuse me, guys. And uh, and walk over here. And you know, there's some some mage classes going on over here. If I, what was that? It reveals a kaleidoscope of swirling colors and vapors, mesmerizing the viewer. I am member of mesmerize. I can hit tab and, and it shows me things. But we're gonna go ahead and head on inside here because that's my quest. So, quest number one: walk through doors. Complete. Now we walk into the big mansion here, uh, and we'll go and rob some places and grab some coins and daggers and, and stuff, and uh, and go serve the the lords and ladies. I wasn't aware of this one um, when it was a Kickstarter. I missed it, I guess, back back then. And the dev sent me this, this early key to this thing, and um, they even mentioned in in their uh, in their their press release stuff about how it inspired by Baldur's Gate, um, and yeah, clearly is. Um, huh? yeah, you guys are, they're waiting. Tread lightly. Roller guards are here. I'm going to go get my stuff first. We do have a, I think there's an M for map. Yeah, yeah, my map. Um, we need to go over there to the meeting room. We're going to go up here, though, to my room, which is this way, and go get my stuff, uh, and see what we can find. Now, we can go around here. Oh, my way. <laughs> I got to you got to stop that. Uh, we can come over here, and we can, we can, like, you know, it's not my house, but it might as well be. Oh, look at my hair. I didn't realize I picked that. I'm embarrassed. Okay, let's grab, um, what are you? A fallen Prince's Tail? Yeah, I know. A little reading for the road. We got ourselves a bracelet and some cash. Oh, what kind of bracelet we got here? And to protect the wearer's forearms. Well, take a look at it. It is a Warden Haft bracelet. Plus one to focus. Ooh, that's nice. Okay, I like that. Uh, pop that on. I double click it. There we go. And I got a book. We can, we can, I guess we can read. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, cool. Um, oops. So it is all real time. Uh, when you get in the combat, did I look in here? When you get in the combat, you can pause. So it's like pause and tactically plan kind of combat. Um, but it's mostly real time. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we can go rob things, but I think we should probably see some stuff here. Ooh, ooh, one second. I'll take a lunar pendant. Can I put that on? What's it do? Just a, just a lunar pendant? Yeah, yeah, pop that on. What necromancer would I be if I didn't have a lunar pendant? There's a library here. We can go rob some more books and scrolls and things. Actually, there might be some spells in here. I said I wasn't going to dally, but we've got... Ooh, an identify scroll. And... Anything else? A... Potion of healing recipe. Okay, okay. Yeah, there's crafting and things in here. We'll find some... You know, we'll get that point in a minute. Voice in the woods... Things are, are organized meticulously. Uh, a uh, potion of cure-all recipe. Okay, okay, okay. Find some good stuff here. 
Anyway, we gotta get to, get to my room here, so let's go do that. And, uh... Get my, my gear. If you say so. I do. Okay, we got a berry juice. And my chest is right here, which has some things. Okay, so we've got a, uh, a scholar's stick. That's what I'll take my, my throwing knives. Uh, I'll just take everything. Okay, and we can pop this guy on that way. I can put a dagger on, too. Yeah, yeah. We can switch between that back and forth. Um, do I know what you are? So, let's use our idea. Unveil the true nature of an item with unknown or magical properties. Okay, okay. Like we just did with that other thing. All right. Um, enough Robin. Let's go and, and do our job. Staff in hand. Let's see what's going on over here. All right, so we gotta go serve. At last. Ugh, don't go twisting an ankle in all your hurry. You take care of the drinks. Lord Wolcraft and Lady Larenthal prefer wine. Lord Joran would like ale. Lady Virulin and Lord Espen want mead. Go! Okay, so we gotta remember this stuff. Uh, actually, you don't. I played through this before. You give them whatever you want and they're fine. But I'm gonna take all the all this stuff and we're gonna go and give it to whoever wants Hello, things. Uh, so I'm gonna be staff. a bad, you know. I can't find good servants. In yeah, yeah, I know. I'm Ugh, the worst. The carriage was uh, quite your ale, lady? I, I do. Hello. So I'm You're sorry. Here. Ah, good. You're welcome. You're welcome. Hello. You're welcome. Yes, yes. Get ail. Beast. But maybe she wanted me. Hello. Uh, <laughs> well? Whatever. Uh, your wine, buddy. Uh, okay. There we go. So forgive me. We are just advancing the story here. Shall we do business, gentlemen, gentle ladies? Yes, let's. We are convened to discuss the situation with Daron Gould. What has been rumored and suspected for so long has finally come to pass. A council of nobles with mining interests in the town have declared themselves independent from the crown of Isilmerald. I don't like this dirty business. Sending a list of grievances to the king. Sounds more like the actions of a bunch of uppity peasant farmers than nobility. There are ways these things are done. And there are ways that kingdoms may crumble. I understand your feelings on the matter, Lady Larenthal. But Darren Gould enjoys the sympathies of many important persons here in the North, and I number myself among them. What's more, there have already been defections among the Azimerald nobility, most recently Aldnar. She speaks of your son, Lord Espen, who chose to forsake his birthright to join the rebels. Ah, yes. Thank you, Lady Larenthal, for reminding me. And I'll thank you, Lady Virilin, not to speak his name on this estate, nor in my hearing again. Oh, why, I will... <laughs> but you won't. Whatever the loyalties of uh, the young Lord of House Espen, the Southern nobles have many legitimate complaints. Heavy. Some say ruinous taxation, delayed shipments thanks to the Crown's regime of inspections and checkpoints, the King's insistence that Daron Gould's military, e even the Town Watch, must be trained in the North. It's quite a list. Yes, it's all very sad. I'm sure they toss and turn the night away on their beds of gold bars. Taxation and bureaucracy are simply the facts of managing a prosperous nation, of keeping our enemies at arm's length. How long would their precious minds keep producing without the king's protection? Did you know I heard this rebellion was prompted in part by a belief making the rounds in Deron Gould that the king himself is cursed? <laughs> Oh my! What exceptional nonsense! <laughs> Have they been breathing the fumes of their own minds? All right, very amusing. But like Lady Varellen, I am not unsympathetic to our southern friends. Surely some of Isilbright's rules and dictums could be culled, especially if it means avoiding war. A much more costly proposition than losing a handful of coin in taxes. Wise counsel, my friend, but I fear the time for compromise is already past. The message from Daron Gould was deliberately provocative, leaving the king no way to negotiate or save face. The time has come, lords and ladies, for us to commit our forces and our purses. 
to our rightful liege and crush Daron Gould. Or throw in with the rebels. They have the gold, they have a well-trained army, and most importantly, they control the mines. In a conflict of any significant length, having control of the source of the kingdom's metals means they must only outlast the North, rather than outright defeat her. You there. What is your opinion on recent developments? Me? Uh, I think You're that... You're asking the errand boy? I think what all, does... uh, what's his face over here? I think he enjoys his voice acting job. Don't interrupt me <laughs> while sitting at my table, Lady Laranfall. Well, speak up. Well, um, 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 I got a little experience in these polygamy. I think it's best if I just, I just keep quiet. Yes. A wise man must always be cognizant of his own ignorance. W what? Thank you for reminding us all of that fact. Hmm. Oh. My ladies, my lords, we are under attack. Please take shelter at once. Perhaps the cellar. You may wish to arm yourselves, my lords. Well, uh, how much time we got? Too little, I'm afraid. Their numbers are overwhelming. We were forced to fall back to the main gate, and they're already... Surely they will listen to reason, wherever they're from. They won't kill us out of hand like so many soldiers. They wouldn't dare, right? Calmly, my friends. Let's all go out to meet them. They're not bandits after all. Yes, go ahead. You have my blessing to speak on my behalf, if it's of any use. You? What? Where are you going? Come with me. Make haste. Me? Okay. Thirsty worthies. Let's go. Uh, yeah, yeah. You and you lot with me. The that main sound. gate has already been breached. The House of Espen is about to fall to the agents of Daron Gould. Now, never mind that. Just follow. And you, you've mm -hmm. always been a first-rate skulker at Key Halls. Yes, your weird hobbies are no secret to me. Best not face armed soldiers head on. But do what you can. Weird hobbies? Well, I'll take that. Okay, always gonna hold tab and see things. Over here, okay, okay, okay. Uh, ooh, fancy gloves. Nice, nice. Where'd you go? There he is. Okay. Oh, bad guys are coming in. Okay, so combat time. Uh, it, again, it's real time. We can pause and do things if we want. Um, I'm a mage. I'm a, I'm a necromancer, so I picked a terrible spell of just doing stonewall, but it looks really cool, so I'm going to go ahead and do it. I'm going to say, let's defend this side with my stonewall. Watch yourself, buddy. And it's very cool. There it is. Okay. I'm gonna go smack her around. She's resisting some things. Again. Oh, ouch! Oh, no, no, stop that. Do you need something? There's more of them. Okay. Make haste. Where are we going? I'm getting beat down. Okay, I'm gonna die. So, uh, what do I pick up? A potion of healing. Let's let's drink that. Okay, I'm going to switch over to my dagger. Uh, this one. I wonder if I use this. Let's use, uh, can I use this instead? Oh yeah, there we go. And then I'm going to switch weapons. To, to that. Yeah, oh, I think we do it here. We go there, and we click on that. And then we can go in here and start swinging at things. But there's too many of them. How am I supposed to do anything about this? And, and there's no way, I don't think of turning the camera around. Um... I'm stuck here, so let's just go ahead and smack that guy. Stand me. Guy's down. Oh no, I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Um, let's try that again. Oh man, it's all over. Okay. Okay. Um. Can I load? Okay, we'll load. We'll do that one. Let's load there. Man, I got destroyed. 
Okay, uh, let's try that again. Uh, shall we? Let's see if we can, can uh, not die this time. I'm going to just stay back. Like, you know what he said about the weird hobby thing? Let's just hang back and, and let, let him die. I guess. Where's this put me? Oh, man, we're back here now. Out of my way. Okay, we go to the drink thing again. Hello, dear. I think... What do we need? Hello. Thank you. That'll be all what? Hello. Have they taught you nothing? Let me have my drink. Does someone not have a drink yet? Come over here. Hello. Leave me alone. Hello. Well. Okay. Oh, uh, there you go. Uh, this... Okay. Now we can do this all over again. All right. But I can fast forward through this, so it's all right. Shall we do business, gentlemen? Yeah. And she speaks. Uh, <laughs> what you do? <laughs> oh, you You're... kindly do um... not interrupt me. Whether or not they're sitting at my table. Whether or not there uh, has legitimate for. grievances is beside the point. They must well, be crushed. Indeed. There is truth in what you say. I have often found fear to be a more useful asset than respect. Okay, now we get to watch it happen again. And this time, uh, we will throw walls up with the best of them. I need to level up. If I level up, I can get new spells ladies, and I can do some my lords, real fighting. We are under attack. You okay. little lime of Surely they come. Yes, you come with me. All right, let's go. Yes, yes. Um, did I find that potion here? I already have that one. Did I already have that? No, I don't. You yeah. and you lot yeah, with just... me. The main gate and you. Okay, give me that potion. I might need it. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. Uh, ooh, let me get my gloves. Pop these guys on. I think I'm gonna make sure we have that. Oh, I don't want. I want to do this. Um, there. Okay. Okay. Well, we can switch over this way. All right. I'm gonna hide out over here. Uh, here they come. Okay. Going on game world. Uh, okay. Let's go ahead and I'm gonna do my wall thing because it's cool. Let's do a spell here. What is that one? Se Severin Sparkle. Hey, what's it do? Oh my. Okay. Okay. There's my wall. Let's put my wall back up. Uh, let's throw there. Yeah. Close them off. Okay, what was this one again? I can't do it again. Uh, I'm gonna leave her alone because she's scary. So let's go over here and stab. I'm not gonna do any talking here. Let's go stab this guy. Also, it says you can also attack both hostile and non hostile creatures by clicking on the sword icon. So we can, like, I'm not surely not my friends. Um, I shouldn't go against her again, but I think I'm gonna. No, let's stay over here and so. stay away from them. They're scary. They got the walls blocked off, though. I changed my mind. I want to go... Is that a potion I had? Uh, what do we have here? We have potion of healing, recipe, identify. Okay. Make that! Two damage! Ooh, yeah. What was that? A stiff breeze. A stiff... Oh, we got her! I got her! Uh, what you got? Give me your loot. Ooh. A magic staff? Uh, oh, yeah, I'll take all this stuff. Can I wear this stuff? We're paused right now. Uh, can I wear a hat? Oh, yeah. I will take that. I will take your new staff. Uh, and... I will switch out my stick with that. Okay. I'm feeling better now. Uh, let me get my uh, this guy out. Well, let me use this. Okay. I might need more loot over there, though. Yeah, okay, yeah. Here I come. Here I come. Thirsty worthies. Do you need something? Make haste. Okay. Watch your step around. Oh, 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 more of them. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go hit them with um another wall. Do I not have the ability to do my um? Oh, it's because it's not identified. Okay, yeah, it's identify that thing. Plus two focus grants a level one base spell slot and a level two. 
Do I now have another space slot? Oh, Alright, let's go smack that guy. Ooh, there's a bunch of them. Okay, get the sword out. That one. That one. Go get him. Go get him. Why am I just standing here? Where's he going? Where am I? Where are you going? There you go. There you go. Okay. What do you got? Look at all that stuff. Ooh, a bow and arrow. I could probably use that. Okay. Got. Okay. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm trying to get some arrows. Yeah, no, that's good. I'm going. Okay. Let me see if I can use. Forget this thing. We want this guy. Yeah, yeah. And and these guys. There we go. Now listen to me. Okay. Listen closely. Mm -hmm. This is important. The Lady Espen was the love of my life. My one love. There was nothing arranged about our betrothal. Uh. Can we talk about your dead wife some other time? We haven't time for your smart remarks. You never saw her yourself. Not that you'd remember. But if you had, she... Gods damn these Derongold swine. Behind me is my dressing chamber. Go fetch my sword from there. Um... Maybe a few clever words would be better. Clever words will avail us nothing but a swifter death. Now fetch my sword. Okay, what about the one in your hand? Oh, I've been tricked! Mm -hmm. Well, it wasn't very nice. Well, he means business when he walks like Found that. you at last, father. Didn't figure you would try and hide from your fate. To be betrayed by my own son. Who wouldn't hide from such a terrible end? I've learned a few things, you see. Things your priests and men-at-arms could never teach. I have gained a new perspective. Seen the truth of this world. So... You were not even paid in coin to turn traitor against your own house. Only pretty words. Kill me if you wish, but I promise it will avail you nothing. Every man pays for his sins, my son. And the price of a sin such as this, well... Enough of your piety! It sickens me. But your last decision, at least, is the correct one. Hold still, father. Man, I took so long to get that sword. Don't worry, my child. Your hardships are over for today. Huh? Okay. I don't know. I'm sorry. I don't know what to say. Um, but it's very quiet in here. <laughs> All right. Um, let's go to the Crones College. Cottage. Get up, lazy boy. It's time to go to bed. Uh, what? What? Does this look like Rothgar's realm to you? You're in my hut. Uh, how, how did I get here? I brought you here. Okay. But no more questions for tonight. There's a cot over there. You should try to get a good night's sleep. Tomorrow will be a very, very long day. Uh, okay, okay. So we can rest. Uh, yep. Uh, by hitting the rest button. Okay. Long rest. Wake up. Lazy. Always sleeping, this one. Must have been raised by dream wraiths. Um... Just because you've clearly never heard of beauty sleep doesn't mean that you need to impugn my work ethic. Ethic? Well, if you've got any ethics at all, you'll help an old woman around the house. Now, how about you make yourself useful and weed the garden? Um, just a few more hours of sleep. Okay, fine, fine. I'm a making a stew this evening. You'll be helping. I need you to go find some things for Take us. Take a look at this list. Once you. Okay. Yep, yep. What you got for me? Um, not the journal. That quest. Uh, oh, oh, ingredient list. Okay, right there. 
Gather a handful of bruise root, a brown stem mushroom, and a slab of fox meat. Okay. Um, okay. Can I pet the kitty? Out of my way. <laughs> hey, buddy. No, I can't. All right. Uh, anything you got in here I can pick? What's that? Powder, powder of annoyance. Sure. And uh, some that. Cure all and healing. Ooh, good stuff. Good stuff. And an infusion of berry juice recipe. Okay, let's go. Uh, let's go find some things. Bye, kitty. And do some, uh, um, some. I guess mushroom picking. Is my spell to come back? There it is. Okay. I'm not sure why I wasn't in there before. All right. Out of my way. Okay. 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 Let's go take some more things here, and we gotta go all. Oh. Or, uh, tab, show some things here. Let's see if we can find what we need to, uh, what we need to pick up. What we got over here? This is a, uh, a weevil. I don't need a weevil. I think there's a spider over there. You a friendly spider? Consumable. It is a consumable, but what is it? Is it... I'm not sure what consumable, what consumable that is. That I'm doing there. Um, alright. Uh, I have my bow. Let's try the old bow out. Can I, um... Shoot that guy. What was it, control? Oh, crush him. I missed. Ouch. Nice shot, buddy. Okay. Yes, yes. We have a moon glider. What was my recipe list again? We need a mushroom, fox meat, bruise root. Okay. Yellow spiders over there. Ooh, there's mushrooms. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'll 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 shoot you. Oh no no, back over here. Can I just like um? Let's take a look at this again. Both comes from nature energy that it's conjure the caster's fingertips. Okay, yeah, yeah, sure. Try that. Okay, um, I'm going to shoot you now. You cannot stand against me. These spiders are quick. Good shot. Can I switch back to that thing and just whack them? There you go. If you say so. Nobody gets between me and my mushrooms. Brown some mushroom, that's what we want. Some uh, centipede things up there. Some whatever they are. I need, um... Can you let me pick this without you coming at me? Is that what we want? Bruise root, that's what we want. And then there's a fox. Hey, there we go. Um... I guess we get like one spell a day. Is that what's going on here? No, there it is. I don't know. All right, well, let's go uh, get ourselves a fox. No, oh, sorry, buddy. Okay, and that. All right, let's uh, let's go eat. I'll leave those guys there. They seem okay. Back into the little hut. I think we have a do we have a map here. Yeah. Ooh. We'll look at the world map here in a second once we get in. As long as she doesn't talk to us. Yeah. Okay. Okay. There's. I think it's where we were. All right. Feeling well. I'm feeling great. Oh, good, good. You know how to read. I have something that will help you gather what we need without hurting yourself too much. Here, put these on. Okay. New gloves. Gardening gloves. All right. I feel like I should have had this good. before. You put your gloves on just like the rest of us. All fingers at the same time. 
You weren't trying to put them on one finger at a time, were you? Off with you. When you've got everything on the list, come back. By the way, be careful of the creatures in the forest. They can be a bit bitey. Take this stuff as well. It should come handy should you need to protect yourself. A staff? I guess I should talk to her before. What is that? Uh, a traveler's cane. Okay. Um, alright. Alright. Feel free to take a rest if you need. Uh, it's all there. Yes, perfect. Okay. Um... Some sort of reward for this? No. No, no reward. In any case, of course, there it is. You get to eat tonight. Now, let's have a look at what you brought. What? What's this? Did you forget to make these herbs edible, child? Come now, you must try them to bring out the flavor. Surely you've cooked before. I have to wonder what that Lord Espen even had your tutors teach you at his fancy estate. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, take this candle and get to drying. Okay, crush the herbs into power, powder. So we have something to season the stew with. All right. So we have to go drying. And we go, this is this is the stuff. Then we go over to that one for, okay. Put the candle in down there. And then the goods go up here. It's like these guys. And this guy. And what was the other thing? What was the other thing? I don't remember. Was it a moonlighter? I don't remember. Hey, we're gonna try one. Okay. By such replenishing health and restoring spell abilities, rest also finishes your brewing and drying tasks. Okay, let's rest. Collect your dried ingredients from your inventory. Start crushing them. Okay, collect those guys up. And, uh, and here you go. I hope we got to the right stuff. Good, good. Well and dried. Give me just a moment and... There. It's on the fire. Now we have a few precious moments to spare. We should talk. About talking. So, um... I have skills in learning and research, so I should be able to do this one. Bargain or pers persuasion? No, but you're trying to teach me something. Very good. I think you already have the hang of it, but in case that was a fluke, the idea is taking the time and effort to gain knowledge, even learning to talk will benefit you greatly in the difficult times ahead. Pay close attention to what you might uncover in conversations. Uh, thanks. That's a valuable lesson. Um, stew almost ready? Yes, yes. Okay. Now, there's something you should know. Okay. When you leave here, the world you knew yesterday will be gone. Go on. The attack on the Espen estate was only the first spark of a consuming fire, I am afraid. Much will be lost to strife and war. There are worse things than war, though. There is something you must understand before you leave here. A great and terrible curse has fallen over Isilmerald and much of the rest of Yerengal. It drives men and women to madness. It starves the prince and turns the pauper to a life of desperation. It is the essence of avarice itself. A curse of greed spreads through the land. Greed? What do you mean? A terrible covetousness that hides in mortal hearts. It is among the darkest of dreams. But this is no normal greed, no. There is magic behind it. No mere apprentice's catrip either. It is most dangerous. And you must understand that. Ah, the stew is done now. Just let it cool. Okay. Get a good look at you now. You're a bit of a magician, aren't you? Uh, well, I know how to make walls. Fair specimen of your abilities. Yes, yes, you have much to learn. Let's get you started. Here, take this. It's a scroll containing a spell for you to learn. Give it a read. Oh, yes. Yes, please. Summoning spider. <gasps> yes, please. Scribe that spell. Very good. I see the look of recognition in your eyes. You know a new spell. You must learn as many as you can. I say this with care. Magic will keep you alive, but it may also hold unforeseen dangers. Now, there's a trap in the room. Get re uh, ready to give you a little scare if you aren't careful. Go and see if you can find and disarm it. No time to waste. Okay, click on that one. And then we're going to go, uh, what's this one? Magical perception. Click on it. Uh-huh. Very good. Freezing enchantment on the trap was a, but a mere nuisance. 
Okay. As a wizard, you'll be running across many peculiar things on your journey. Some will mean you harm. Uh huh. Getting a good look at you now. Yeah, yeah. Um, you're a fighter, aren't you? <laughs> I know how to sing and wing a weapon, if that's what you mean. Anyone can. Real test of a warrior isn't confidence or muscle. You stay alive long enough to become a veteran. You need a brain. See that chest over there in the corner? Yeah, that one. It's locked. Okay. Open it for me. Using force lock. Okay. Don't worry, child. There's a treasure inside, but you will have to get past the beastie to get it. I'll be joining you for a short while to make sure you don't stab yourself. If you want to learn to inspire allies, follow your orders. It's important to practice. Okay. Here comes leader of the party. Okay. Click on me. What? My party company. Set as commander. And then sleep. To apply commander perk, you select the party needs to rest together. There's a bug in here. Is it really good the time to rest? Okay. 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 Where's the will? Yes, sir. So I can control you now, right? Feeling well. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, walk up there and... Uh, what do you have, spells? No. What is that? That is abolish curse and dream. All right. Uh, yeah, let's go uh, s smack that guy. Go wait, can I summon a spider? How do I learn to use that spell? I'm missing something with spells, and I do not know what it is. Um, my stuff is over here. Hmm. I don't know how to how to adjust my book though. Map, operations, this is all this kind of stuff. Party sheet, character sheet, spell book. This one. Ah, excellent. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, and then stone walls there. All right, all right. That's what I'm looking for. Um, can I do it? No, because I just did it. Okay. I'd like to do this, but I'm... All right, fine. Let's go kill that guy. I will grab my bow and shoot it. All right, do we need to talk to you or something? Where's the something fight? you want bashed? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah. Very good. You're learning your way around the fight. Remember that you often won't be alone on the battlefield. Now, what was it that we... Oh, yes! Stew. Stew is cooked and cooled. This will warm you after a long, long day. I see that look in your eye again. No. No more questions for today. Eat your stew and get some rest. Uh, okay, um, I'm assuming I needed a rest to get the spell available. I'm going to put a wall on your house if you don't mind. Yeah, there we go. Okay, uh, I'll eat my stew. Do I have to eat my stew? I don't think I do. Okay, uh, and then we're going to go take a rest. Good morning. Hello. I fear that our time together is nearing an end. About time! Yes, yes. It's time for you to return to the world. I needed to be certain you were ready. Uh, is that all? Yes, that is the gist of it. Things were put in motion all over Yerengel since I plucked you from your father's house. My father's house? Lord Espen? I won't explain how it happened. But why didn't he tell me? I cannot say. He had his reasons. There's a reason Lord Espen paid you so much attention despite your servitude. Other servants surely did not receive the same education or the same favors, nor did anyone else in the house excepting your half-brother, Aldnar. He killed our father. I refuse to believe any of this. Very well, yes, yes. I've enjoyed our time together. Be safe, my child. Mom? Anything else in here? Ooh. Light leather armor. But I got some vestments of the prodigy, which seems like a good thing to have. Out of my way. Out of my way, old lady. Okay, so let's go, let's play the game. Um, I realize we're 45 minutes into this, but we're going to see, um, I'm going to see if we can find a, a friend. Explore our world here. Can I go anywhere else? Hmm. How do we travel over there? Maybe we got to go just walk the edge of the map? Hey, buddy. I go. I'll take one. Sure, I'll take one for the road. 
Get out of this place. There we go. Okay, now we can go... There's Yeah, there's Espen Estate again we can go back to, I guess. There's... That's all I see right now is that. And Merchant Road. Okay. Let's go visit the Merchant Road. I'm really hoping to see a party member join us here so we can uh, get to... Uh, well, see that part of it. Rather than just the witch. Or whatever. Whatever she is. And I really want to see my spider. So I will be summoning that. Whether we need it or not. Maybe we can kill some uh, foxes or something along the way. So I'll put the um, I'll put the Steam page down below in the description to check it out. Also, uh, I noticed on there 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 I guess there's a limited amount of keys, but there's a demo oh, available. I'll put links to that if you can't find it. It's on the Steam page. There's a link to getting the demo for this. A demo. It's not it's not an easy findable spot. Shockwing, sure I'll take it. All right, nice trip to the market. My, my spider spell seems to be working. Um, another day at the market. Ooh, I'll take some new boots. I don't think I do. I need that. Can I wear that chainmail? Slashing stabbing it gives a bonus intelligence boost. Having this armor, which is probably what I want. However, I'm a fighter, necromancer, so I'm gonna wear that. Yeah. And the new boots. Oh, I can't wear the boots. Oh, wait, I'm too overweight. Let me throw this on the ground. And uh, I'll throw this on the ground. I might need that shield. I'm going to throw it on there anyway. Okay. Uh, who are you, buddy? I'm listening. A sorry sight it is. <laughs> Watching the crows, are you? Birds are lucky. They got... They need not ponder what drives men to their bloody deeds. I'm Helgenhar. Call me Helg. That's too much of a mouthful. Why were they fighting? Is that a serious question? Even a league beneath the Skag Mountains, everyone knows of the war. Uh, I'm not a seasoned warrior. I have a, I have a point in prodigy. Soldiering is a messy business. I'm glad I have no part of it. Don't be so sure. We may all be dragged into this before anyway, the end. This was one of the smaller battles between a sealed bright and dead and gold. Uh, since we're on the same road, why don't we work together? Walk together. I think the same thing myself, but both habit and predilection I always are always careful of my companions tell me what brings you on this desolate road alone and tell my story I'm a simple traveler like you forgive me I cannot believe that first you're not equipped for sleeping outdoors and second you look as if you never once done it I'll ask again he says all right I'll tell him my story wow. that's quite a tale if I was a bard I'd be taking notes right now huh. it stands to reason that with your father dead you are the heir to his estate I don't know what I should do about that. Lay claim to it yourself. No one's going to walk up and hand it to you. Okay. This is the road to Asilbright, you know. Capital of Asilmarild, and also the world's capital of noble titles. Um, seems like a good place to go. Uh, care to join me? Excellent. Onwards to Asilbright. Hooray! I got a companion. Excellent. Hey, buddy. I'm listening. Yeah, you. Um. There's your character sheet. Your skills. You are a seasoned warrior. You're, you're a fighter. You're a dwarf fighter. Okay. Um, where do I get the sheet? Multi-class human. Where the will? I mean, we probably Where's find you some good the... things here. Um, but I really want to kill something. Yes, yes. I would love to raise the dead. That's what necromancers do. But not this necromancer. Anything around here we want to we want to stab? Oh, this guy. Hello. Good day, kind sir. On your way to Isla Bright, I warrant a wise choice given the circumstances. It's been several days since I fled Darren Gould. I was already doubtful of our chances when Isla Bright before the War Council decided to make its move. But when plague struck, I grew certain I was on the wrong side. What's really going on here? Can you not have heard? Have you been living under the bottom of a sea? Darren Gould declared war on Isla Bright a few days back and has already gained foothold in the south of the kingdom. Militarily, it was quite the feat. Terrible illness has raged across the city almost immediately thereafter. Citizens have been taken to their beds several weeks before, but no one thought it was serious. Now they've begun taking it, taking to their graves. And in the dozens. Took it as a sign to leave town, but you don't go call me a coward. A merchant has no true home anyway, and uh, that's how I look at it. And you know, I managed to bring some of my wares with me from Darren Gould. Care to take a look? Uh, sure, what you got? 
Okay, merchant inventory. We can see what he's got. Switch between party member inventories using the drop down on the right. Uh, oh, yep, this one. Okay. Uh, you got all this stuff. Uh, Helgenar would like, um, he would like a potion of, uh, of Battle Roar. How much? 16? How much do I got? Uh, I don't know how much I have. Oh, 36. Uh, uh, he will take a potion of healing, most importantly. And a, uh, and, and, and that one. One of those. And, oh, can't afford both of them. Um, that'll, that'll do. Okay. If you say so. I thought maybe he was going to join me. That's how we get out of here. We got, we got to go find, I can't end this until we find something to kill. It's the right gates are right there. I guess that's our next step in our journey here, isn't it? Oh, there's screaming barrows. If there's a place that wants fighting, that's where we got to go. Um, let's go see what's over here first, since we have to walk the other way. We'll see if there's uh if if it's if it's gonna be like a rat, we'll kill it. Uh something is going to meet the fate of my spider. We don't know what yet, but something. Again, it, it, it says down at the bottom, it's yeah, it's real time, but I guess it is turned because some things do take turns. Uh which is which is I guess five seconds. There's a cat over there. Out of Hello. My way. Can't wait to visit Market Street. Everyone seems so happy here. Please, please. No one cares for the poor in the city. They just look the other way. Hmm. Okay. It certainly has a Baldur's Gate feel to it. It kind of reminds me of like some of the Spiderweb games too. Stand two there. What's your business in the capital? Not a merchant, by the look of it. Um, I'm an heir to the estate of Lord Espen, claiming my birthright. You think you're a what? Long lost son of a nobleman? Well, I suppose there's no law against being delusional. I assure you, there's no laughing matter. What are your feelings about the Darren Gould Rebellion? I will strangle them to death with my own, with their own innards. Yeah, yes, do. yes. Oh, yeah, we can go... Okay. Um, sure, we'll pop in the, the market street here. This is not probably going to be any fighting. Maybe we'll find a rat. There's a couple cats there, apparently. Judging by the screen. I'm, I'm out of things to talk about, and it's just eerily quiet. Uh, so I apologize for that. But we're going to let this thing load. And uh, um, walk around Market Street. Eventually. Brilliant sleight of hand, Horiel. That weak princeling of the brothel still doesn't know. He's a lighter by the weight of one fancy bracelet. We need a little more of Crag's ailments to get properly treated. Someone's coming, I think. What a propitious moment for you to walk into our lives, winsome stranger. My friends and I are collecting a small fee from everyone in the city. A pittance, really. Fifty gold pieces. Uh, looks like a shakedown. I don't stand for shakedowns. Brave? Stupid, but brave. Smash time. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, okay. Um, let's smash. So, we're going to kill what? that... That guy. Out of my way. Oh, do, your, do this thing. That guy first. Got it. Uh, and then I Where's am going to cast Sviders there. I'm listening. And you're going to go, yeah. What does that one do? Vigilance. Sure, do your vigilance thing. Okay, and then start smashing. Yeah, spiders! Uh, I, I will um, right. throw out a wall, I guess. That's kind of what I do. Um, yep, a wall it is. We're going to wall that guy off. There we go. That'll show him. Okay, why don't you go punch that guy? Look at that one. Shoot over the wall. Nope. Yes, yes. Oh, yeah. Ooh, they have all kinds of stuff. Uh, mag uh, magical bracelets. Stones, a sling. 
Okay, what's this, what's this guy over here have? Is this is this the whole group? It is. Okay. Um, what what we got here? Where's that bracelet at? There it is. Plus seven percent bargain and persuasion. All right. Oh uh, yeah yeah. I'll wear one of those. Where, if you say so. But what were you doing the whole time? You just watching? Move along. Excuse me. Hello. Ain't you a lively one? Oh. I'm more lively than the ones back there. <laughs> uh, where are we going to get a drink? Try the stumbling steps at Greg Bark Square. Not the prettiest or tidiest, but the drinks are cheap. Also, risk of getting a knife between your ribs. Okay. Other option was the Crooked Haggler, Market Street. Okay. Drinks and drain my wallets, but I want to go to the. Not that one. Um, temple. I guess, yeah, okay. I guess we'll go to that one. Here we've got fabrics over there. we got wares that way. Um, yeah, we'll go... Can I do, like, fast travel? Yes. Not really. I'll go buy some things if you want. I'm sure there's other party members we can get here. I guess we can have five party members, according to that. More bums. Uh, hello, commoner. Let's go in here. What's this guy want? <laughs> okay, okay. I am... Uh, okay. You... Okay. What? Okay. Sorry, I asked. Another load screen. I believe so. We're gonna. <laughs> no, no, no load screen. Excellent. Excellent. Well, I mean, we can go help ourselves over there. Let's go. Let's go in here. Who's this? I, oh, I thin. I want to pour more of the thin eye in the oven. What? So Lord, we got another Lord. We got you. Look like someone that would join yes. our party. If anywhere to ask, I would compare Lily, Lady Biala's exquisite presence to the light of dawn. Okay, okay, yeah, My she's right. Are too kind, but you know, I'm finding it a titch stuffy in here. I believe I will step out for some air. Let me fan you, my lady. I do carry a fan. Wild creatures are pheasants. Huh? Really, my lords, I have a needlepoint back at my apartments that I'm most eager to complete. If you'll excuse me. Nonsense. Now wait another minute till you select me over these two vagabonds. What a spectacle these men make of themselves. A dwarf woman would know how to handle such a situation. He wants to go help. Yeah, we'll. Always ready. Yeah, we'll look at that. Lord Smedrick, as much as your poetry is alarmingly metaphorical. I still must insist that you speak to no one regarding your thoughts on my resemblance to a flower bud ready to open. Um, bargain persuasion, we can say... Prodigy, Millie, there you are. Most eager to consider our discussion on funicular imperity. All right. Uh, Helgenar, can you think of some way to scare these ninnies off? I believe I can, he says. Yeah, with your axe. That gem on it. Why, why does the camera do that? It's quite remarkable. We're in the middle of a... It is indeed. I have a discerning eye for stones. Thank you, milady. But I wonder, did you know that such a gem has a withering effect on those whom it is pointed? Kind of a slow-acting magical poison. I feel I did know that at some point, but somehow it slipped in my mind. I must take my leave. I was really hoping that for... That was neatly uh... done. Who do I have to thank for my rescue? I was really hoping for some axes. Uh, me. Um, I am Undinti. Glad to be of service. I am the Lady Biola of the Feldegog, darling of the court and spellweaver extraordinaire. But of course, you know all that. I'm not strong enough to carry the ledger I would need to keep track of every self-important noble. <laughs> uh, I can't say I do. You don't know me? How delightful. I'm so tired of the endless legions of fawning earls and viscounts and hangers-on. Um, okay, I'm uh, trying to figure out, yeah, some guy killed my, my dad. What luck. Uh, this position of noble titles is particularly a second career of mine. I must allow me to accompany you. I will make sure you find what you wish to know and thereby repay the good turn. Okay, splendid. I do need the help. We try the palace first. Okay. Hey, we have another party member. What did she do? Yes. She is a, clearly a spell weaver. Spell caster. Okay, and what kind of spells you got? What was spellbook V? Oh, she has 
uh, Snow Fever, and you have Spiders too? Huh. What does it mean you can cast... Oh, am I doing this wrong? Where's the wheel? Yes, uh, boy. Let me do that. Like maybe I'm doing it wrong. Maybe three spells per day. I think that's how that works. Um, all right. I really need to call it a day here. But we're going to go upstairs real quick. We'll go upstairs. We'll check out the inn. This is what you do. It's a fantasy game. Uh, and, and then we'll call it a day. This is Black Geyser, Couriers of Darkness. It's out uh, here on the 26th. I'm just going to go rob some things. I was hoping for some, um, something to go kill. Locked. Oh, well, let's open it up. Uh, with my lock picking what? skill, which was this one. What? Who locks an empty cabinet? Yes, yes. Excuse me, everybody. I'm listening. Well, I go. We get a letter over there. Locked. Okay. Uh, can you force it as well? Yeah, you can. And you got a nothing. More locked things. Can you... Are we going to have a pattern here? Oh, we got a bug. Alright. Good job, buddy. It's a nice bug. Okay, let's, uh, let's call it a day. So anyway, thanks for watching. And I will see you next time.